Okay, let's see if we can get to the pharmacy. That was a horrible idea. I don't know why I did that. Okay, we're still getting chased. Um, let's find that pharmacy again. Here it is, here it is. No, I'm going to get trapped if I go in there. Oh, man. Okay, yeah. No, I have to get rid of the zombie. Don't hit me, because if you hit me, I'm dead. Oh, we did it! Oh, is there cloth? I don't know what good that's going to do me. Um, let's try to use it, though. Rough white cloth. No, it doesn't look like we can do anything there. Oh, man. Let's crash down. There's something here. Morphine? I'll take it. You know what? I need that. I need that really bad. Ah, oh, that's better. That's only like 10% though, but we got a med kit too, so let's use that because I really need it. Oh, we'll see how much that helps us buy. Vitamins, I'll take those. Oh, and that helped my radiation. Or my sickness level, I believe is what it's probably is. I'm doing a lot better. I, my health is at like 60... Um, food's at only 50, my sickness is 39, which is better than like 70, which is what I believe it was at, so, we're actually doing in a, I don't want to say decent shape, because we're actually still doing pretty bad, um, but we're alive, and I think we should be able to stay alive a, a lot longer, um, let's see if we can find a backpack, though, because that's going to be the most important thing, just like DayZ. Well, all the items you find, they are very, very important in your survival. If you don't have a backpack, you can't even carry them, and you're not you're not going to last at all. So that's one thing I really need. I wonder if there will be one in this store over here. No, the store is empty. Completely empty. I wonder if there's anything in this... Doesn't look like it. Let's jump out the window here. Check out this guy's house. Maybe this guy was an avid hiker and carries a backpack around everywhere. Bonjour clip. I need that. Um, let's reload. Oh, this is already full. This one, it doesn't look like I have any ammo in it at all. Oh, yeah, I do. But honestly, I think I'd rather have a bonjour mag for my barrette rather than a pistol clip because I think this barrette's going to be a bit stronger I can snipe them instead of just rush into the town I could probably even I probably should have even found a roof I could go up to um, because I don't believe they can climb and just uh, gone up there and shot them all is what I probably should have done when I was dying but hey at least at least we're not dead that's the thing we're still alive we get to live another day all right, let's check out this firehouse. We got a f torch, which is we call flashlights here in the real world, unless you're like British or something. I don't know. Not gonna blame you. You got chem lights, so you can tell this game was obviously inspired um, by Daisy, but it is completely different. So just because something is inspired by it does not mean they are copying it. I really enjoy this game. Um, it said it's a headlight. It's all it, it's not a headlamp, unless I have to take off my current hat to put this one on. Can I put this one on? No! Okay, if I can't put it on my head, don't call it a headlamp. Thank you very much. Alright. Spawn Mag doesn't have a lot in it. Actually, I could probably combine it with this magazine here. Whoa. What happened? Oh, so I can't combine the magazines because one has four out of five and the other has one out of five. All right, well, if this only has one bullet in it, I'm just going to take the other magazine. And I already lost it. So I guess we'll, <laughs> we'll take this one until we can find something better, I guess. Hopefully the police station will have ammo and or weapons that we can take. Um, but there's only one way to... Police armor. I wonder if that's better than my armor. 
A bandage? Oh, I have to take the bandage. But actually, I think I might have to drop everything to grab that armor. So we'll just put everything in this little corner here. We'll take the police armor, equip it, put it on. Drop our, yep. The police armor has to be stronger than that. We'll leave our magazine behind. What's this here? RCMP uniform. A Stetson, I'm so taking this. Hold on. I'm so taking the Stetson. Mine. Now where's my bandage? Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to use the bandage right now so I can carry that magazine still. Because I still need that health. So, I mean, it's not going to, like, do me any good to keep holding on to it. Let's try our, uh... Let's actually re... Let's do it like this. We'll reload. So now we have the four right here and we'll try and shoot this zombie here with our bullet Woo! I hit him oh it looks like it automatically reloaded so the empty mag is now on the ground actually I want to try this mag whoa takes a couple of bullets I like the guns though. I personally like melee better, but it's a lot more dangerous. Uh, this clip is now empty, um, which is mainly why I shot it with the Mosin. Um, so I could just get rid of that clip because I really don't want to carry it around and have to keep dropping it, picking up other stuff and stuff like that. So I just used it. Um, but it looks like we made it to a port here. We got a gas can. Um, actually, I'm going to take the gas can. And we're going to try and fill up one of these cars and drive it out of the city. I think that'll be the plan here. Got some scrap metal. Don't have any room in my backpack for it. Is that a s sledgehammer over there? Let's take a look. It looks like there's a chem light. Yep, a red chem light. And nails hiding behind there. Nothing else though, that's about it. Gotta stop using all of my energy up on sprinting when I'm not being chased by zombies. Yeah, this is pretty nice. I'm gonna take this gas can into the city, see if we can fill up a car. Alright guys, so I found the car that had the most fuel in it, and I'm gonna add my fuel in it here in a second, but I also found this this huge helping of food and water in this house that I hadn't gone in. Um, I'm hoping there's backpack upstairs because I'd love to take this bottle of water with me but it's looking like if I want to take actually you know I will take the bottle of water because I'm gonna use this gas can here in a second so let's go ahead and drop this bottle on the ground take up my gas can pull it into my hands this car over here has the most fuel currently inside of it with 17% we're going to put more fuel in it and we'll see what it's at now. But first I got to go grab my water. Because that is a large water bottle. I'm probably going to need that. My... F Whoa. This is probably empty now. Empty, yep. But my... My dehydration's down. My hunger is all the way down. My health's pretty high up. My radiation's pretty bad still, but... Alright, so let's, let's drive this puppy around. There's a dead end over by the docks. I don't remember if I showed that. So uh, we're going to have to leave this city and find a new one. And I think... I don't want to drive my car into the town because you saw what happened when I went into the town. I almost died. Driving a car in with all this noise and stuff will make it so much worse. So I think as soon as I find a town, I'm just going to jump out of my car, leave it outside, nearby somewhere, and uh, walk into the city. Okay. There we go. So there's a little, a little town. It doesn't even look like a town, just more of a campsite. I know there are zombies that I passed. Uh, looks like they stopped following, though. Either that or I actually ran them over, but I don't believe I did. Um, but we'll just leave that right there. We'll come back to it as soon as I finish 
looting this town over here. What do we have here? There's quite a few zombies. I'm going to try and sneak in. Get one aggro. There we go. Draw him out of the city. And then kind of take him out. There we go. Now we'll go. It's going to be hard to grab just one of these guys without aggroing the other. But we'll see what we can do. Come on, guys. Let's go. Oh, I got one. There we go. So we're going to try and slowly take these guys on one at a time so as not to attract a ton of attention to ourselves at once before we even start looting here. And we'll see how this works. What's this? A canteen. Oh, I could so use a canteen. A moldy carrot? Don't really want a moldy carrot. Oh, geez. Okay, he can get up here. I didn't think he'd be able to, to be honest. There we go. Oh, I hear one. Oh, there he is. Oh, that was a stronger one. Did that guy get aggro? Nope. Khaki pants? Yeah, we'll take the khaki pants. Let's go ahead and put those on. There we go. Now we actually have pants. That's always nice to have. Don't want to be flopping around out there. I mean, I could have chosen a better red than that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, didn't see you, buddy. Rising from the dead. Oh, an Uzi. Oh, I so want to take that. You know, yeah, we will take it. Who needs a Mosin? I, it has, like, no ammo anyway. See how much ammo this thing has. Four bullets. Okay, this has even less ammo. Yuri ammunition. I haven't even seen any of that, so we'll just take the Mosin. And we'll take... I think this is the last guy in the city, so we should be able to take him out. Boom. Now we can loot the rest of this place. Sailor fatigues. No, I think we're good. Orange chem light. Don't want a chem light. Not too sure what they do, but I'm pretty sure I have no use for them at the moment. Extrim magazine. Don't know what that's to. Um, so we just won't take it. Magic cloak. Okay, I'm taking this. What's it do? Investigate your head for scars. Okay. What did it do? Yeah, let's yeah, let's just uh let's just stick with our police armor. I don't think we need a magical cloak. Cuz I'm not sure it does anything important. Oh, we were just in here, huh? I think I got this guy aggroed on me too. There we go. Oh, I think we looted this place. Didn't have anything in it. Nothing too interesting. So let's go down here and see what the...